This is Ryan Abraham and Jared Perez, uscfootball.com. Instant analysis from lovely Hawaii, as you can mm -hmm. see. Uh, Waikiki behind us. Uh, we are at the Polynesian Bowl, second day that the players have been here. First day of practice, uh, Team Makai and Team Mauka. And uh, five USC signees are playing in this game or, or at this game. And a couple of guys that are you know, on USC's target list. And Jared and I got to kind of split it up a little bit and watch. You know, we each watched three different guys today. One player isn't here yet, uh, Deuce Robinson, the big uh, tight end wide receiver. He's going to arrive tonight, so we didn't get to see him yet. And the other uncommitted player is uh, Roderick Pleasant from Sarah High School. I got to watch him a little bit. But, Jerry, you were over on the other side. Uh, Malachi Nelson, he's not out there playing. He's the, the five-star quarterback because he's got his uh, labrum is hurt. But you had a few uh, USC guys over there you got to check out. Yeah, I did. I had Quentin Joyner running back. Uh, he had a really good day. Um, a lot of walkthrough, but still really created a lot of oohs and ahs out there. So that was cool. I also got to see Amos Talalele, offensive guard. And he was actually blocking for uh, Joiner. So that was really cool. Got to see both at once. So that was a good one. And then a sprinkled in a little bit of Makai Lemon. They filled it in. He played well as well. Yeah, another five-star. Uh, so he's Malachi uh, Nelson's high school at Los Alamitos. Five-star wide receiver. So we got to see him yesterday checking in. The way these work sometimes, as you know, you come out here and some guys aren't doing a lot. Some guys are taking every rep. I love to see the guys that are out there trying to take every rep. And it doesn't always happen that way. Sometimes they're just the drills that they're running for certain position groups aren't going much on. Were the wide receivers over there doing much as far as that position group stuff goes or just didn't see much of Lemon? I just didn't see much of Lemon. He yeah. just got to, he, he relaxed. It was, yeah. it was a casual day for him. <laughs> <laughs> but he made a few catches. I got a good one of him. Uh, catching at the shoelaces, so that was a, a sweet one. But yeah, it was kind of casual for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quentin Joiner is someone that you got to see. Uh, he's already had a great All Star game. He was the only uh, USC guy that was at the uh, uh, All American game in uh, San Antonio. But um, he's someone that kind of like he catches a lot of people's attention when he's out here. You're right. Yeah, he did, and he drew the attention of almost everyone that was watching him. So. A lot of good plays from him. It was the first time I've got to see him because he's a Texas kid and I'm, I stay in California. So, uh, yeah. So it was a, a good, pleasant surprise seeing him. Yeah, pleasant. No uh, pun intended there. Because we're gonna go to the other side of the ball. Mm -hmm. I think I forget which teams we are. I, I think I was Malka. You were Malka and I was, I'm Mackay. You were Mackay, and you had Mackay Lemon on the team Mackay too. Mackay Lemon on Mackay. Uh, speaking of offensive linemen, uh, Micah uh, Benuelos, we got to see him out here a little bit. Now they, I thought the offensive linemen. Uh, for Malka, they did uh, they did some good drills. Sometimes you can just kind of see some footwork stuff. Mm -hmm. Other times they're just kind of standing around, being told what to do. Uh, and you know, you wanted to see them move a little bit. We got to yeah. see him move it. He's pretty much been there, you know, working in their first group at right guard. Uh, we talked to him yesterday. Could play center, could play guard. But mm -hmm. uh, the two offensive linemen here, it seems like they're representing themselves pretty well. They did. They did. They did play really, really well. Um, Amos, another thing I got to say is his calves are like the size of my head. So he's a big, thick dude with a big base. So that's really interesting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of big calves, uh, Zachariah Branch, I think is the highest rated player in this game uh, for USC. Five-star uh, wide receiver out of Bishop Gorman High School. Looking at his lower body, it is, I mean, it looks like it was sculpted. It's yep. crazy. Watching him getting ready, he actually won the fastest uh, man. They had a, a contest here. They put you know two guys out in a 40-yard dash. He won that one. Uh, but just jumping in in place to start before that he was moving and uh, just to see him running routes we got to see him run a bubble screen like over and over and over again because they were kind of running the same play again one of those weird nuances of practice but man he's someone that just when you see him playing near other all-stars he's someone that looks the part right and he looks like a finished product physically built like it doesn't look like another pound of muscle can fit on him yeah. so it's like as the, he's a smaller guy, but there's just so much maxed out in him, this thick legs, sculpted body, like you said. Yeah. And can do backflips whenever he wants. <laughs> yeah. there, were, there were some backflips going on, yeah. and uh, he was going, it was funny, the interaction between him and uh, Roderick Pleasant, so the highest ranked 
the uncommitted guy that USC's after in this game, like I mentioned already. Sarah High School. He was what now Branch was in every rep as the truck goes by. Uh, Branch was in every rep. We're a beautiful uh, Kamehameha High School, by the way. So that's why, I mean, this is like, this is where they practice uh, football here, which is crazy. But uh, he was in on almost every rep. He wanted to get as many reps as he could. I wasn't seeing the same thing from Pleasant. And then I talked, to, ended up talking to one of the Adidas reps, who's one of the sponsors of the game. And he said, yeah, his cleats weren't fitting right. So he said his feet were, I asked him, his feet were killing him. So we didn't get to see much of him. Hopefully we'll get to see more of him. But there was a lot of talk between him and Branch. The whole group is trying to commit him to you know end up at USC. Right. So we'll see where he ends up going. But the interaction just between watching Branch and Pleasant was uh, it was pretty entertaining. Yeah, Nelson definitely made his pitch. <laughs> Zach is never quiet about it. And yeah, they drew him in. They had we had to do a little photo shoot and they got Pleasant in the photo shoot. So that was good. Yeah. So that was good. So you could see him in there. Uh, but yeah, so five USC commitments. We got to see him check in yesterday. We got to watch him practice for the first time. We'll have a bunch of footage. Uh, Jared and I were both out there shooting footage of the guys that were out there playing, everyone except uh, Malachi Nelson. And we'll see hopefully Deuce Robinson uh, tomorrow and get some footage of him too. But for Jared. This is Ryan. Hope you guys enjoyed this instant analysis here from beautiful Kamehameha High School. Talk to you next time.